the retention component is huge when you're talking about digital fitness or any type of digital subscription. But then you have this added layer with fitness where willpower at some point fades away and churn is inevitable. How do you think about the adherence or retention component to make sure that people are engaged and continuing to use the product? I think engagement has really been such a core part of what we've been doing. You know, most reviews of our app was like, where, where have you been all my life? And I think it was because we we were kind of one of the first players that was really focused as much on the experience inside the app as getting you inside the door. And so it's through a lot of different mechanisms we focus on engagement, whether it's the quality of these workouts, making them really bite-sized. So it's approachable. Most people don't have necessarily 30 minutes to an hour to work out in a day. And so making these bite-sized movie style content that is really accessible, layering in the social experience. It's a lot about life cycle marketing and introducing people to, you know, you're not going to want to work out necessarily every day. Is it sometimes reading an amazing article or making a recipe and a lot about introducing new content. One of my biggest learnings, I was working on hardware for five years and, you know, I found the hardware game was very hit driven, right? And, you know, the second you launch a, a device within a month, it almost already feels like it's already old. The beauty of software is really about bringing new content all the time. I love that when you work in digital, we could film some workouts with Halle Berry. I think we launched them within five days on the platform and um, could build this, you know, more broader wellness solution where sometimes it's about a workout, sometimes it's about eating healthy, sometimes it's about learning. You know, I think we've seen some great results before we, when we've looked at like industry average day 30 retention for the category. It's pretty low. It's like 15%. We've been lucky and fortunate to be about 4X that today by just really focusing on engagement and caring so much about that. It's not about day zero and like entering the app. It's about how do we keep them engaged throughout the pipeline with really new, interesting content and mechanics into the product. 